hold your own so today like i said last episode we've got to make a trip to the cave because we got to get a serious amount of iron it's unfortunate that the hunters are here now because they're going to make this trip a little bit more dangerous than it was the first time we made it um but basically we want to get our anvil and our anvil is going to take i think it was like 20 yeah 20 iron ingots we have three so we've got a lot of those that we need to get, and plus we're going to need, I'm assuming, the iron in order to make the fragments for the nails, obviously. So it's just, we just need to do it, or we're never going to get any walls up, and we're not going to make any progress. So my arrows are almost done. I have no more bullets left, which is also unfortunate, but I did make some arrows. Now, I did want to try to hopefully go pick up our car over by the bridge but we definitely have some hunters in our path that we're gonna have to try to take care of and hopefully we can drive to the cave I feel like that'll be easier I know you all really enjoyed my awesome driving skills in my other episodes I've been told to potentially try the third person view so we'll try that see if it makes my life any easier I'm sure it'll make it a little easier, but I think my driving skills just suck. Chelsea. We want to be careful. There was... Well, maybe not here, but up a little bit. There was definitely some hunters lurking. Oh, look. There's one right there. Yeah, you're going to be a problem, aren't you? Oh, no. Oh, did we get a headshot? I don't know. I feel like it wasn't. You keep giving me shotgun bullets. I don't have a shotgun yet. Can we make a shotgun? Weapons? Oh. Nope, we definitely can't, but maybe with the advanced workbench or maybe something else will make it. Who knows? Those are not the bullets I need. Oh. I feel like I... Yeah, I see somebody. Oh, we got a headshot that time. I'm getting better. Is it getting dark? Oh, we are not doing this in the dark. Well, we're going to pick up the vehicle, I guess, but we are not going to the cave in the dark. Now, where are we trying to go? Up here? To my vehicle? I feel like it was up here. I mean, I could just call it to the garage. Seems like a waste of a hundred bucks, though. Yeah, we should be coming up. Yeah, because the car is like, should be like right over here, right? Is that my car? Are you my car? That's definitely my car. Before um, the update and the new development, uh, you, a lot of times your car would despawn. It was unfortunate. And you couldn't get it back. So, I mean, it's still here, so that's that's progress right there, but we want to turn around. Okay, so, um, what is this? The view? So this way, I think, is the way they're saying should be easier for me. I really got to turn around. It's not easy. Okay, car goes, like, really fast. Okay, we're doing it. We are doing it. Yeah, we're just trying to get back to base. Slow down there, buddy. Just take it slow here. Not an experienced driver. This way is definitely ooh, a little bit easier. Let's not speak too soon there. 
Uh, I think I just followed it this way, right? Wonder if I can run over the NPCs and kill them that way. I don't know. Well, I just hit something. I feel like they shouldn't be able to shoot through my vehicle. Hoping this is an armored vehicle. Oh, there's an NPC there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't come after me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh yeah, we are wicked at this. Okay. Well, we have brought our car home for the first time, finally. Oh, well, yeah, well, we can just come right there. That, that's, that works for me. All right, so we are going to take a sleep and then we'll head out to the cave. So I'll see you guys in a bit. All right, so we are up in the morning, 4 a.m., ready to go. What's my gas looking like, actually? We still got like 22. I think I have some gas in here, so why don't we just throw that in the car because it's just taking up space anyways. Don't want to run out of gas. That would be bad. Okay. Now, let's take a quick look at our map and see how we are going to maneuver this exactly. They almost make it look like there's a road right there. Is there a road right there? I don't really see it. Alright, well let's get in the car. We'll take the way around just in case. Whoa, you kind of glitched me a little bit there, buddy. Yeah, there we go. Am I still in the right? Yeah, this is still the, the easier way to drive. Maybe I should go up there. Mm. Maybe. Let's see. Go this way. Whoa, 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 That was a little insane there. Well, my driving skills have gotten a lot better. Look at me go. Okay, whoa, 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 is this like a... Okay, I think that was a little bit of a shortcut. So my waypoint, I guess we'll be turning off to the right on a road here soon, hopefully. Yep, right here. So we're gonna go up this, no, 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 I'm not into the tree, you dummy. Yeah, you big dummy. All right. Then, so we are, whoa, 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 wrong button. About to do some donuts in the middle of the road there. Okay, so, is that a stop sign? Oh no, we gotta watch out for cows. Don't wanna hit cows. Now it's raining. Lovely. So we are close to the cave here. I don't wanna miss it. If I go... Nope, you're turning the wrong way. My cave must be up there. Oh yeah, it's like on the other side, isn't it? So we will just park you right here. And I will run up over this hill and I'll see you guys in the cave. Alright, so we are entering into the cave here got to be careful because there's going to probably be hunters in here. There could be, possibly, but we are here for as much metal as we can get our little hands on because we need a lot. 
Was that a regular rock or was that iron? Those are regular rocks, right? That's a regular rock. A regular rock. I'm, I'm gonna be lost in here. That's what's gonna happen. Well, I can't really get down there. I don't know how to get back up. came in at right. Uh, so dark. Aha, we found some. That. All right, so I'm going to gather up whatever metal I can get together. I'm sure you guys don't want to watch me smack these rocks. I will bring you back if any kind of excitement happens. Fingers crossed it doesn't, meaning no hunters come in here and try to kill me. So I'll see you guys in a little while. All right, everyone. So I made it back safe and sound. I'm um, waiting for this metal to cook up. It's only got about 12, 15 seconds left anyway, so not too bad. Um, so the tw uh, 100 of the iron ingots is what will give you, obviously, 20... Sorry. A hundred iron ore will give you 20 iron ingots, which is what we needed for the anvil. So let's go put this in here and see if we can't craft ourselves that now. So we can make that. I wanted to try to make this, but uh, we don't quite have enough water bottles, I think. We're like four water bottles short. I mean, I could easily drink my water and waste it and whatnot. Um, and we'd have to make one more ingot, and we'd probably have to make some screws because I only have the four that are there, so I'd have to at least get two more. So I would say that's probably next episode. We will try to make sure that we get that together so that we have our water tank. We've got a few other benches we want to work on. Everything pretty much requires iron ingots, so it's going to be a lot of traveling back and forth from the cave for me. Um, so we've got about two minutes for this anvil to actually cook up or craft up, whatever we are calling it exactly. Um, once we have that, we'll be able to figure out uh, how we're going to make the nails. And then off camera, I will work diligently to try to get our myself all closed in get a little base set up here a little beach house um so that that's done so hopefully by next episode when you see me obviously we will be encased in some walls which would be great and then we've obviously got some benches and things we got to worry about setting up um, as well as completing some more of these active quests. Um, so I think this has about a minute or so left. Not that this. Yeah, about a minute. So I will see you guys in a minute. All right, so we've got our anvil done. So let's place this somewhere in our base. Most of everything will be able to move, which I'll be doing off camera because we don't want everything all stuck together like this all right so let's see in order to make fragments we need ingots one ingot will give us fragments five five fragments at a time so looks like we will be crafting up some more ingots in there getting some fragments on the go and then we'll be able to make some nails each nail um mold will make 10 nails i'm pretty sure which isn't too shabby but that's pretty much it so we pretty much accomplished what we wanted to today we made the long trip to the cave i went and actually i'm going to save this before anything bad happens um so we went we retrieved the um car and finally brought that home because we haven't done that yet we've just been leaving it all over the place i appreciate the tip in um switching to third person view um, which did make my life easier when actually driving I still 
you know, need some practice, you all saw. I'm not that great, but I definitely did better that time around. Um, I really do appreciate all the support so far and everyone joining me in this episode. Um, and as I said, next episode, we will hopefully be in a base um, and we'll start working on some of these benches and things like that um, and finish up. Maybe we'll go speak to Cynthia and see what she wants. So I will see you all next time. And if you did enjoy the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't done so already, hit that subscribe button. See you guys next time.